houses. The fool had said in his heart, there is no God. I want to talk and preach a lot of sermon. And preach a lot of sermon. But this sermon is top-notch sermon that the church needs. You preach about a lot of stuff, but we got to preach about this one. And we don't preach about it enough. I'm talking on a subject called, Does God Exist? Does God Exist? Now, who exactly is the man who declares there is no existence in God? Come on, what the Bible tells us in the text that God calls that man a F-O-O-L. God calls him a fool. Amen. Now connected to fools are atheists and agnostics. According to God, not me. The Bible says something for 14.1. For, the fool Amen. had said in his heart, in his heart there, no God. there is no God. It started in your heart. It get in your mouth. Huh. Sound off your teeth. Uh -huh. Slide off your tongue. You That's how we talk. Start in your heart. Get in your mouth. Mm. Teeth start up. Chittering words and they come out, amen. Well, yeah, for you know it, you done said it ain't no God. I'm hearing black men saying it ain't no God. Come on, I'm hearing white men say it ain't no God. Come on, I'm hearing brown skinned men say it ain't no God. But I dropped by to tell you that a fool had said in his heart, There is no God. Now, question, does God exist? Amen. The fool says, no. No. The fool states uh, his proposition that he cannot prove. The fool makes arguments that he can give no answer to his thesis. The fool will declare his conclusion that warrants no evidence. The fool question is, I want you to know the fool question ain't cool. Amen. To be a fool ain't cool. Come on, I'm going to rub that in. The fool, is it cool to be a fool? <laughs> well, stupid. the fools don't have the right to. Oh. To use, to disfuse the existence of God. Amen. Now, what make what does a fool do? Well, a fool will corrupt your mind. Yeah. Amen. The Bible says don't walk with fools. Amen. Don't keep company with fools. Amen. But let me tell you real quick, jumping ahead, what a fool need. A fool need to get with cool. Come on, no. uh -huh. Let me give you an acronym for cool, C O L L. Christ over our lives. Amen. Come on, come on. That's what a fool needs. You need Christ over our lives. Come on, preacher. Now, what is a fool? What is the acronym for F O O L? False over our lives. Yeah. That's why you're a fool. Yeah. You got false all in your mind, all in your heart. It said in the text right there that the fool said where? Not on his tongue. In his heart. He said in on the inside. Amen. He said, now folk are getting bold on the outside, but the food said on the inside of his heart, there no is God. no God. Amen. But thank God. Amen. There are some atheists who are jumping off the ship. Come on now. Anthony Flew. Uh, he had a debate with Brother Warren Thomas. Uh, yes, uh, Brother Warren. Yeah, Thomas Warren had a debate with him, and uh, he lost miserably. He lost about the existence of God. He lost 
miserable. Now here's the good news. He jumped ship. He was talking all that stuff. It ain't no God in the debate. And then just before he died, see God tick on your conscience just before he died. He said, you know, I feel a jump ship. <laughs> I ain't dying like this. I ain't gonna die as no atheist. God been talking to my conscience. And just before he died, he declared that there is a God. Amen. Wow. Now what is God trying to do this morning? To get you to change your position. Amen. Yeah, yeah. That's all God wants you to do. Go from your no to a yes. Yeah. And if you go from a no to a yes, then that will lead you to a confess. Yeah. That thou art the Christ. Mm -hmm. The son of the living God. Yeah. We're talking on a subject called what? What did I give you? Does God exist? exist? You come better, on, you come better on, hear me. Okay. Does on, God exist? Come on, preach. Now, these are some deep thoughts. Yeah. yeah. When you get to talking about the existence of God, uh -huh. this is a very deep, deep Thought, amen, wall, uh, about God, uh, the existence on. of God. Now, for my remaining time, I want to ask you, because you're going to be the jury. I'm, 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 I'm giving my argument to the jury. And then, as they say in court, we're going to uh, let it rest in the hands of the jury. And y'all going to go in the jury room, and y'all going to come back with a decision. Either God exists, or God does not exist. But let me gather up the evidence, amen, wall. The existence of God. Now my question is, have atheists proved that God does not exist? Amen. Well, have they proved that? No. And my answer is no. no. Now there are two views about God. One, the first one, is false. Amen. God does not exist. That's a false view. Amen. The other one is the correct view. God does exist. From everlasting to everlasting, thou art eternal. God have always existed, have always been here. Now, what did God do? Well, God reached in to nothing Amen. and he pulled out something they've been wrong. I tell you, only God can reach on the inside of nothing and pull out of you, Amen. pull out of earth, pull out time, uh -huh. pull out space. Uh -huh. pull We the members of the AD 33 Church of Christ, our position is, and we ain't going to change, our position is, God is the living God. Come amen. On, Come if, on, it, if, it, if it wasn't for God, it wouldn't be no us. Amen. Come on, Come on. You don't hear me this morning. On, there are two opponents yeah. fighting for position under the basketball goal. On, Who are the opponents? We're opponent one, are believers in God. We believe in God and we believe in the book of God. Come because on, I notice when folk want to deny God and say he don't exist, not only they attack God, but then they attack his book. Oh, you can't depend on that book, amen. On, that old ancient book, amen. Wow, well, outdated book. Uh, yeah. uh, that, that book need to be thrown away, amen. Wow. But it's the number one bestseller still today with the internet, amen. Wow. You don't hear me, amen. Wow. So opponent one are believers in God. Opponent two is atheists who deny God deny God exists. They Come say on. all kind of things about God. Amen. Well, yeah, yeah. But here's back to Psalm 14:1. Well, come on. Says what? It said the fool. Amen. Has said in his heart. Has said in his heart. In his heart. There's no God. There is no God. Come on, preacher. Now God got a fool list. Are you on the food list? Come on, preach. He Say got a food list. Say it's preacher. a long list, amen, wow. Whatever you do, you don't want to get on God's food's list, amen, wow. Right, right, the foolish said, come on, give us your all, amen, wow. Come on, preach. The old virgin said, you know, you better go on uh, to the store and get your oil yourself. Because I can't give mine away. If I give you mine, I ain't going to have none left when the bridegroom come, amen, wow. Talking about Jesus. So the first 
fool I know on the fool's list. Come on, Prince. He's got to be number one. We're we going to start with the greater to the lesser. But you know who number one is. Huh. Lucifer. He's amen. the first fool, amen, well. Up there in heaven with God, amen. Come on, you better How you going to give heaven up? You got to be a fool to give heaven up, amen, well. Say it, say it, say it, say it. Man. Make me right. say, what the hell you want in hell, amen, well. Come on, Brenton. You, you appear in on, heaven and going to give heaven up for hell. You Come got on, to be a fool, amen, Come well. On, now, you a damn fool, amen, Come well. On, now, the, the, the next fool, uh, on, I, want, I want to travel, uh, 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 leave heaven, and I want to make my uh, way down here. There's a guy named Michael uh, on, Shima. Uh-oh. And Mike, uh, I'm talking to you. He, he's, he's a white, white boy. He's a white brother. I'm calling him white brother. Come on, preacher. Mike, listen to me. I want the word to get back. Come on back to the church. Come on back to the church of Christ. You used to be a preacher in the church of Christ. And you got on the wrong road. You became a skeptic. And now you skipped over there. Now you declare yourself an atheist. Come on back to the church of Christ. Get in the pulpit like I am. And start preaching Jesus Christ once again. On, I'm talking to Mike Shima. Amen, Walls. Amen. Come on back to the church. Come Amen, on. Walls. Come on back to Jesus Christ, amen, Walt. Because what happened to flu is going to happen to you. As you get a little older, you know God, uh, he talking to your conscience. And then I know he talking to your conscience, amen, Walt. I know he is, Mike. Come on back, amen, Walt, before it's too late, amen, Walt. Come on, preacher. Now, there's Richard Dawkins. I've heard your best argument. Richard? What evidence do you have that prove that God does not exist? Come on, preach. Your evidence does not warrant your conclusion. Come on, preach. Richard? Tell it. Look at me, Richard. Dawkins, you better get it together before you get out of here. Come on, preach. I already told you about Michael Sherman. Yeah. You need to come on back to the, the church. church, amen, Wow. Come on, come on. Tell now me. Now listen to me. I'm going to talk about some more of these atheists. I'm going to mention some more names a little, little, little later, but listen to me. Atheists fall under the banner of what? Unbelievers. All amen. atheists. If you're a fool, that's the banner you fall under. Amen. Unbelievers, amen. On, that's who atheists are. Come on, preacher. Yeah. You can give them the word till you turn blue. They don't want it, amen, Wow. Come on. Because they don't want God. They don't want the authority of God. Amen. That's what's wrong with them. You don't want God telling you what to do. Amen. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Exactly. Tell the preacher. Example. Come on, preacher. Stand up, Nachi. Come on, preacher. Just stand up. Now go sit down in the next chair. Scoot over and sit down. Yes. Now see, that's faith. Amen. She didn't have to check the legs. Well, I don't know, uh, preacher. The legs might not be no good, amen, wow. Come on, preacher. She sit down in faith, amen, wow. Come on, and preacher. we come inside God's house, and we sit down in faith, and we believe in faith. Yes, we're fallen, on, but preacher. God going to catch us, amen, wow. Tell it, preacher. Tell it. Tell it, preacher. Tell it. No, no, you serve a God that's going to catch preacher. us. God is the on, existing God. Amen. On, Lord. Preacher, now listen tell to me. Now. So Come you on, sit preacher. You preach it. You preach it. And you preacher. trust that seat. Come on. And I say likewise. Come on. As you said in Kia in your seat. Come on, preacher. You are obligated yeah. to trust Almighty God. Yeah. Amen. Come on. Come on. Now let's let's get to some good stuff. Come on, Come on preacher. Take it to prove Take it God exists. Yeah. I must know where he came from. Yeah. No. That's at least what my opponent says. Come on, preacher. Well, your question of where God came from indicates that you don't know very much about God. Where God came from, you asking the wrong question. Come on, come on now. The God of this book. Come on, preacher. Is not affected by time, space, or matter. In Genesis 1 with 10 words. Huh, tell it, tell it, preacher. We see a trinity yeah. called 
The big three, amen, wow. Come on. Amen. We see time, space, and matter. Come on, Bert. Yeah. Now listen to me. If you have matter, mm. but you have no space, question, where would you put it, amen, wow? And on the other hand, if you had matter and space, but you had no time, when would you put it, amen, wall? All three time, space, and matter, they work together, amen, wall. And I would have you to know about God, that God is not in matter. He's not in earth. He's not in time. He's outside of all of them. Come on, let me tell you something. Y'all got a you. You got a computer. Come on, preacher. When last time you seen a man that made your computer inside your computer, uh, updating it and, and and on your you ain't seen him, Amen. Wall, and you ain't gonna never see him because he's outside of what he made, Amen. Wall. Come on, preacher. Come on. He ain't the computer. He's just the creator of the computer, Amen. Wall. God is the creator of this earth, Amen. Wall. Now in Genesis 1-1, one, one, look at the big three. Space, matter, and time. Ten words. Here we go. In the beginning, in the beginning it says, that gives us what? Time. Yeah. Notice it, then it said God created. That gives, he created the heaven. Yes. That gives us what? Space. And then he created the earth. That gives us what? Matter. Time gives us what? Past, present, and future. Come on, preacher. Space gives us what? Length, width, and height. Come on, preacher. Matter gives us what? Solid, liquid, and gas. Come on. And our God, our Creator, yeah. He ain't in these things. He's outside of those things. That's what makes Him God. Come on, preacher. Listen, if God is limited by time, space, or matter, then he is not God. Amen. Well, I have a, uh, a God who made man, and listen to me, man, the best thing you can do is this morning is obey God's gospel plan. Come on, preach, tell it, tell it. God, man, God got a plan. Come on, preach, tell it. And it's a good news plan. Come on, come on. And you must obey the plan come on, preacher. before they say amen over your body. Amen. amen. Come on, preacher. Take now, as I near close, come on, take your time, preacher. Take your time. What a fool said. Let me get back to the fool's list. Come on, preacher. There's a man named David Silverman. He is president of American Atheists. Yeah. Amen, Wall. And he writes on his blog. Here's what he said. He said, religion is a beat. I'll let you use your imagination. You can talk about religion all you want to, but one day you're going to have to face the God who gave us that good time religion. Amen. Wow. See, pure religion undefiled before God the Father's is this to visit the fathers and widows in their affliction and then keep oneself unspotted from the world. James 1 and 27. Now there's a black brother. He's an atheist. His name, Ralph Jones White. He's a former world class heavyweight kickboxer. He writes to you black folks and he says, I'm disgusted with y'all. With the idea of a black Christian. Amen. Well, he says, Haven't you had enough masters? My Lord. He's talking about your master, Jesus Christ. My so Lord. haven't you had enough masters? My Lord. You did have a master that you could see. Now you claim you got a master you can't see. My God. You going to let him talk about Jesus Christ like the that? The devil is a liar. The devil is a liar, amen, Wall. Amen. And that's all the devil can do is lie, lie, lie. Amen. When he ain't got the truth, amen, Wall. Amen. Come on. Come on. That's all he can do, amen, Wall. Amen. Michael Sherman, Church of Christ brother, he said, God does not exist. Y'all know Woody Allen? He's made the food list. Former actor, former comedian.
got a, got a wife, but is messing with the daughter. No. You see how I, what a fool do? Amen. We're talking about fools. Amen. That's Philip Roth, a novelist writes, when the whole world doesn't believe in God, it would then be a great place. Did you hear that? No. Let me write that. This, this atheist says, when we get rid of God, then we're going to have a better world. Mm. 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 You ought to be saying something right now. That you ought to be upset with that amen wall. Wow. Wow. The devil is a liar. Amen. Then there's a, another atheist named John Brockman, a literary agent. He said, I'm sure on, there man. is no God and I'm sure there is no afterlife. Come on, preacher. Oh, now listen to me as I get ready to close. Here's what these atheists saying about God. They saying he's unloving. They saying he's sick. They saying God is dead. Yeah. They saying God is an absent land over. No. They saying God ain't fair. Look at all the evil they men walk. No. Look at all these folk hungry. Come on, you supposed to have a God, a loving God, and letting all these folk go hungry and and then, then, then he let my son get killed. Why? Well, with God. When my, my son got killed. My Lord. And I asked the same question. Wait. My God. He's in the same place he was Amen. when his son hung on the cross. He's in the same place. Come on, praise God. In heaven, he looked at his son. He didn't hear his son, so his son can save sick folk like us. Amen. Come on, come on. Come on. Every last of one of you sick, sick in your heart, sick in your mind. Amen. On, we speak too well about ourselves. But God said, you ain't nothing but filthy rags. Amen. Come on, yes, That's all you are. Yeah. Come on. Little worms crawling around. Come That's on. what God said about you. Come on, now, all these things that people, <laughs> folks say about God, they ain't nothing but damn lies. Amen. Of the devil. They are lies Amen. of the devil. Amen. 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 And, the truth that's, and that's all the devil can do is just lie, lie, lie when he run out of alibis. Amen, Walt. Amen. Amen. I got to close. I got to close. Does God exist? Come on, preacher. Amen. Yes, he does. I can give the moral argument that, that proves that God exists. Amen. Now, as I get ready to close. Come on, preacher. Come on, preacher. Where do we get our morals from? Morals. Because if you're not interested in being moral and having manners, no. then you're wasting your time. Come on, preacher. Yeah. Come on. Where do we get our morals from? We get them from one place. Amen. Come on. The master. Amen. Come on, preacher. The master of morals. Amen. I'm talking about the one that Peter said. Mm. In him was no God found in his mouth. Come on, oh. come on, preacher. I'm talking about him. Yeah. Who never lied one time. Come on, preacher. Come on. I'm talking about him who never stole a, a one time. Come on, preacher. If you want to know where we got our morals from. Come yeah. on, preacher. We got them from our master, Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. Amen, Walt. Yeah. Amen. Come on, preacher. We get these morals. Yeah. We put them in a book. Amen, Walt. Come on, yeah. preacher. Yes. Come on. You need a moral compass, amen, Walt. Yeah. Amen. When you're on the water, you need a compass if you want to get around. Come amen. on, preacher. When you're walking on land, you need a moral compass. Yeah. And see, I'm watching folk talk. As the word give, laugh, got your own conversation. That's why we can't learn in church. That's why it's a waste of time because you got your own conversation going. Come on, you're preacher. You're not interested in hearing what God said. Come on, preacher. What you saying now ain't even worth it. Come on, the Christ. only one that deserves to be on the flow is the Lord Jesus Christ. Come on, Christ. Tell then him. when he's finished, you can talk, amen, Tell, tell, tell now, the Tell Now, I'm him. talking about a deep subject. The devil is doing a damn good job right now. Lies. Convincing people. When you get in trouble, where you call that? Come on, look, at, look, 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 look what happened to your son. Look what happened to your girl. Come look on. what happened to your money. Where your God at? Come on, preacher. Stand it, punching holes in him. Come on, Come preacher. On. I'm telling you, I believe just like Peter said, thou art the Christ. Yes. Come on, Come on. Son of the living yes. God. Amen. Yes. Well, you ain't nothing but a liar, Come devil. On. Amen. Well, Come on, Dick. So on one mass of our morals, 
is the Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. I've got to shut it down. Come on, preacher. Well, we're going back to Psalm 14 1. Come on, preacher. Come on, preacher. Well, we looked at the food. Amen. List. Yeah. The only question left. Are you on that fool's list? No. Because, see, you can come to church. Amen. But that don't mean you believe in God. Amen. Come on, preacher. Come on. Just because you come to church, that don't mean you believe in God. Come on, preacher. Say, Amen. Walk. Come on, preacher. Amen. Come on. Because a lot of things you ain't going to say on your tongue, you can say them on the inside. Yeah. Come, on. Come, come on. on. come on. Come on. There are a whole lot of things I said to God uh, in my mind, but I won't say them with my tongue. Amen. Walk. Huh. Amen. Come on, we get in traps. Come on, the devil put pressure on us. Yeah. And we get exposed from where we are Amen. based on the problem that he sets in our life. Yeah. That problem is there designed to expose you. Yeah. Whether you're going to have faith in God yeah. on, or Christ. faith in yourself. Amen. Come on, Come on. Come on. A whole lot of people throw God away. It ain't no God. God does not exist. Come on, Christian. So I raised the question, does God exist? Yes. The world say he don't. But now I ask you, do God exist? Yes. He does. See, the Bible says in Matthew 16, whom do men say that I am? Some say John the Baptist. Some say Elijah. But then he says, now I'm going to turn to you. I heard what they say. Yes. Now I'm going to hear what you say. Come on, Christian. Who is that? And Peter couldn't wait. He said, Thou art the Christ, Christ yes, the Son of the living God. Hallelujah. And Jesus walking on the road one day, amen. Walk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they began to talk about food. Amen. Yeah. Walk. Come on. And they didn't understand the food uh, a conversation. And, and, and Jesus said, Except yeah. you eat the flesh huh. of the Son of Man, you have no life Come on. In, yeah. in you. And from that day, John 6. Come on, preacher. The Bible says they turned around huh. and walked no more with Jesus. Come on. Huh. They turned around. Come then on. Jesus so looked get back. at his in the twelve. He said, will you leave also? My Lord. And then Peter says, what you waiting on? Lord, we ain't leaving. <laughs> Whom yeah. shall we go? For thou has the words of eternal life. Yes. It ain't nowhere to go. Amen. Ain't nowhere. Ain't nowhere to go. Amen. For the atheist man. Amen. Ain't nowhere to go. Come on, preacher. For the agnostic man. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ain't nowhere to go. Come on, preacher. For the whole monger. Yes. And the liar. Yeah. yeah. I would have you to know. Yeah. That God is still the same God. Yeah. A long time ago, yeah. Yeah. he destroyed two whole cities. Come on, yeah. preacher. Come on, tell Come on. Tell it, preacher. Because the men in the city, yeah. they didn't want the titty. Yeah. 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 Come they on. didn't want the titty of the woman. Yeah. Yeah. They wanted the titty of a man. Amen. Yeah, 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 come on. And God says, I'm on this. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. Preach. I'm going to get you out with some fire. Amen. Yes. Lord. Come on. Go ahead. I'm going to put pain on you. Amen. Go Lord. Ahead, yeah. And that's going to stop it. Amen. Lord. Tell it. I got to get rid of you because you're hard head. Amen. Tell Lord. it. Tell it. I can send Moses. I can send Elijah. Oh, I can send preach. Elijah. Whoever I send, you ain't going to listen. Yeah. So I got to burn your ass. Up, Come on, preacher. That's what he does. He gonna burn Come on, America up. Come on, preacher. You better hear me. The fire's coming. Come on, preacher. Some of you don't even believe the fire is coming. Come on, preacher. First time I'm gonna destroy him with water. Yeah. Uh -huh. But the next time yeah. it's gonna be fire. First off, and Ohio player said higher. Come on. High is the fire, amen. Right. Now what's gonna be in what's gonna be in here? Brimstone. It's gonna be brimstone. Come on, Brimstone. Give me, give me. Y'all got to do this for me. Come on, I'm gonna let y'all close me. Come on, let y'all close me. Come on, Brimstone. Now, now, how is it? How? Give me somebody. Give me a demonstration. How is it gonna sound in here? Come on, give me a demonstration. No, no, no. Give me that. Praise God, praise God, praise. Put your hands together for that. I love that. Amen. That's it. Now that's a good clue. Y'all do that. Well, how hell gonna sound? One more time. No, 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 no.
than ever. Does God, does God exist? God exists. And this God who exists, exists. He, what he really wants to assist you. Amen. Amen. He's here to assist you. Amen. But the only way he can assist you is by faith. Come on, preacher. By repentance. Amen. By Amen. confession. Come on, preacher. By baptism. Yeah, Amen. yeah. You know, by the water, then you walk in the newness of life. Amen. Come on. Why do you need this message? Because later on in the day, you're going to need it. Amen. The devil going to come to you. Amen. Yeah, yeah. You're going to get in a jam. Bravo. And the devil going to ask you the main question, where's your God at? Amen. God know you need these things. Yeah. Yeah. God know you hurt him. Yeah. And then look at where his church at. Mama. See, you, you, you ain't got no God and you ain't got no... Where's the church folk at when you need it? Yeah. See, the devil throw everybody in. Come yeah. on, preacher. He goes up to heaven and try to accuse God, then come down here and accuse us to God and vice versa. Amen, Walt. Yeah. Come on. Okay. Whatever you go through, the message is God exists. Here's what the atheists don't have that we have. Amen. We got faith. Faith. Amen. Come on, now, please. you can have all the logical arguments you want to. You can establish your prize, proposition, your thesis, and then under that, come in with argument A, argument B, and all of that. And you can say if A equals B, then uh, B, A and B got equal to C called syllogisms in logic talk. Mm. If this is this and then that is that. But what we got. Or with a fool in Psalm 14 1, we got faith. Amen. Now, the way to escape from being a fool, I said earlier, you got to go to cool. Amen. C O O L, Christ over our life. Amen. Amen. And you got to leave the F O O L, Amen. false Amen. over our life. Amen. A lot of people got false over their lives. Amen. You got in your heart, your mind, soul. And it's weighing you down. It's affecting your body. Amen. Come on. Let's come to Jesus. Amen. Because I don't know if I'm going to be here tomorrow. Amen. I'm here now, but I don't know if I'm going to be here tomorrow. Amen. And you don't know either. Amen. James 4, 13 and 14. For what is your life? It's just a vapor that appears for a little while. Amen. And then it vanish away. Amen. Won't you come to him? Amen. Come to the one that hung on the cross. Amen. And died for your sins. Mm -hmm. Every last one. Mm -hmm. Will you come? The Spirit say come. The bride say come. The Holy Spirit say come. Whosoever will. Revelation 22, 17. Whosoever will. Mm -hmm. Let him come. Do you have the bravery? Do you have the courage? No. To say yes to God. I've been saying no. No, 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 God. But today, based on what I heard. I want to go from a no to a yes. Amen. I've been saying there ain't no God. No. But after listening to this bald head preacher, I want to change my position. Amen. I want the whole wide world to know that I believe in this self-existing God. He's the uncaused cause. Nobody made it. Amen. From everlasting to everlasting, thou art God. Amen. Come on, Come on. And he made you, but he don't need you. Amen. Come on, preacher. You need to understand that. He Amen. made you, but he don't, he don't need you. Come you on. need him. Amen. Come on, preacher. Come on. We all need God. Amen. So why don't you come? 2 Corinthians 6 2. Now it's accepted time. Now it's the day of salvation. On the day of Pentecost, Acts 2 37, they asked the men and brethren, what shall we do? No. And Peter says, what? He gave an answer. He says, repent. Change. Repent. Amen. And be baptized. Amen. Every one of you. Yes. In the name of Jesus Christ. And yeah. that for the remission of oh, your, your sins. Sin. You got to do it God's way. Or no way. Or no. hit the highway. Amen. 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 Thank you, dear Lord. Sweet harmony. Oh.